A friend of one of the victims found the bodies of a man and woman inside the apartment at 904 West 21st Street just after 5 o'clock tonight. Shannon Wilson is live. We're invited into the apartment, killed them both, and then walked out. It's something that's really concerning everyone that lives in this neighborhood. Mayor police have been going in and out all night. They are gathering evidence, but we'll only say right now there are two people dead inside Shot that apartment. Defense. And it's possible they both knew their killer. A 911 call sent officers to the upstairs apartment in the 900 block of 21st Street. That's where KXA and Shannon Pally at Mondo's police say that they are investigating the deaths of Stacy Barnett and John Goosey as homicides. A friend found the bodies just after 5 o'clock last night in an apartment on West 21st Street. Joining us with the latest developments in the investigation, Shannon Powell is live from APD headquarters. Shannon? Hey. Oh, no, Stacey, what's going on? Hey, did you hear about this? No. This is two beds today. So, uh, me and your roommate. It's good. Which one? Both of them. I mean, I got a lot of love to give. Are you serious? Yeah. You should really stop this, because karma's gonna get you back. Karma, uh, whatever. Um, so. Oh, sh yo, uh, I actually gotta go holla at Fred, roommate, so I'm gonna see you later. You just got your food. I'm not even hungry. Alright, I'll catch you later, alright? Alright. Shoot, this poster won't stay up at all. You just leave it alone. No, I gotta fix this thing. Hey, by the way, how was that Kevin term? It was totally rigged. Like, nobody in the in the class could pass it. Really? Yeah, it was, it was terrible. Sure. Anything important? Nah. I think it's just some girl I met at a party a few weeks ago. Totally wants me. Hello? I'm sorry, Jason isn't in right now. This is his roommate, Brian. Uh, I'll have him call you when he gets in. And you're not going to do anything about it? Hey, shut up. It's not my problem, all right? Come on. Hey listen, uh, do you do you know this girl? No, I don't, but damn, she's pretty cute, man. Yeah, I just found this picture. I'm gonna try to find her, you know. Yeah, dude, but <laughs> she got that little Asian thing going on with that peace sign. Yeah. Pretty cute, dude. Look kinda, yeah. you know. She's alright. Gonna add it to the list? I'm gonna add it to the oh, list. Shoot, you man. already know. Gotta slow down, dude. Gonna hurt break too many hearts. Shoot, man. You know what I mean? Yeah. I'm just saying, but hey, I'm about to head out to my room, just watch a movie. I got some uh, some things I'm gonna work on in the room. You know? <laughs> I got you. All right. All right, I'm gonna let you go. See you later. Man. I'm gonna head up.
So you did gymnastics for seven years? Yeah. Okay, so that must mean you're pretty flexible then, huh? You can say that. Okay. Well, you know, maybe one day we can go to dinner, and afterwards you can show me how flexible you really are. Call me sometime. Oh, yeah, for sure. I think I got some paper. I'm sorry, I, I, I gotta go. For next week, read Abnormal Sexuality in Literature, Chapter 7. It's a short chapter, so be ready to discuss it in class next week. And um, everyone's free to go, but Jason, can you stay to talk for a second? Do you want to see me right now? Yeah, just be a second. 